<sighs> Stunning. Beautiful, 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 beautiful. Look at the views. This is so awesome. Cheers. Cheers. It's the Hawaii vlog. I'm so excited. I hope you're ready for a full week in Kauai with my family, mom, dad, Jacqueline, Mark, and Jordi. It's gonna be so great. I am just hustling a last little work day and getting packed up. I have all sorts of things to go through and I had just gotten some things from Abercrombie for this trip because I am partnering with Abercrombie on today's video. Came at the perfect time. I have my suitcase almost all ready to go, but I just wanna try on these couple things and figure out which to take with me and then we'll hop on a plane. Speaking of being on a plane, the first thing I got is I've been waiting for this to be my plane hoodie. I don't have a hoodie that just zips. I only have cardigans and ones that pull over my heads. So I'm really excited for this zip up top. There is a sale happening for Abercrombie for YouTube and it's only happening July 21st through 27th. The code is YouTube AF. And I can actually link all these things through the YouTube shop feature that's new here on YouTube now to make it really easy to shop them. But this, Oh my goodness, the material of this, I can't even explain it to you. Like the stretch is so stretchy, a four way stretch. And I just think it's really chic and cute. I get really cold on airplanes. So I'm always looking for something cute to throw over like athleisure wear and look chic. And this is it, this is it, this is perfect. Where is it? Look at that, look at that cute little patch. Okay, next is this cardigan. I've loved the cardigans with a single button trending right now. The material of this is so soft. Like you could tell me this was cashmere and I'd believe you is how it feels. Next one is for family photos. Look at this dress. I'll have to show you the full body. Can I, can I back you up some? Let's see if I can show you full length. Literally for beach sunset pictures. My mom texted me and she said, we're gonna do uh, family pictures on the beach for Christmas cards. So let's all wear like creams and blues. And I had already ordered this dress. So I sent her a picture of it. And I was like, like this? And she's like, perfect. And I'm so excited. I'm just so into anything puff sleeve. I have a very similar version of this dress, but short from Abercrombie. And so I thought that this long one was just so romantic and perfect for family pictures. Next, we have this cute cropped top. It has a matching skirt. The skirt didn't quite come in in time, but I mean, I'm excited to wear those together eventually. I also think it's just so cute by itself with like some high-waisted shorts. Could totally be a look. I might even have just like a plain white skirt, which could look really cute with this as well. But yet again, puff sleeves. I would like your opinion if you like this better with the sleeves on the shoulder or if you like it with the sleeves off the shoulder like this. We'll see which one I end up wearing in Hawaii, but for future reference too, would love your vote. And this feels so supportive without a bra. I'm really surprised by that. I think it's because the back is elastic, so it holds you in. And last but not least, this was just for fun. I placed this order right after the proposal and I thought that these pajamas just looked very bridal. <laughs> and I was like, you know what? One bridal thing might make me just like, it might help it hit that this is real. And I think it's so cute. It comes in other colors too, like not white, but the lace on the shorts of these is just so like luxurious and elevated. And the lace along the top too is so pretty. So I'm a big, big fan of these. It's always a treat to have cute little pajamas. This all layered is like such a vibe and so comfy. Okay, I'm gonna get back to focusing on packing, but thank you to Abercrombie for partnering with me on this video and for outfitting me just in time. I am really excited to throw all these things in to my suitcase and bring it to Hawaii. And with that, oh, we'll have all these pieces linked through YouTube shop. And also don't forget the sales, the 21st to the 27th of this month. And YouTube AF is the code to get 20% off your order. And with that, we have a 15 hour travel day in the morning. We're waking up super early. Let's go. Wow. wow. We've made it. This is not, we're only staying here tonight. We go and check into the spot that we're like staying, staying today. The Airbnb person was like, oh, sorry, actually, the first night you booked, we double booked. So 
we're gonna go check into that today. And um, literally today is just a hangout, readjust to the five hour time difference kind of day. I put that um, sunscreen powder in my hair to not burn my scalp and we haven't fixed the hair yet today. But how are you feeling? I'm feeling great. Yeah? Glad to be on vacation. What is the number one thing you wanna do this week? Uh, jump at the ocean. That's it. I bet. Well, I actually, bet no, we that's my that number happen. two. Number one thing, hang out with your family and like, have a great time. Number one, hang fam. Number two, jump in ocean. Yeah. Number three, see how many pounds of pokey we can eat. Fish. We're making it to the first beach of this trip and underneath these leaves is about to be such a beautiful view. I'm gonna take off my sandals real quick. You ready for this? Oh my gosh. Doesn't it look fake? Wow. Welcome to We've been on this island for 35 days. <laughs> but yeah, we still have a vlog camera. But the We're full charge. Full oh, charge. <laughs> Send help. I got in the water and I feel alive. Yeah. But now I need to put on sunscreen because I just ran and got straight in the water without putting on sunscreen. But just one more just one more look at that. Oh, stunning. Beautiful, 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 beautiful. We just made it to the spot we're staying the rest of the week and I have to show you all the view downstairs, it's awesome. This is me and Jordy's room. The not married kids room. Kitchen area, den area, and then look at the views <laughs> straight out here. Can you believe? And here's Jacqueline and Mark's room before they officially move into it. Can you just believe it? I'm just, just, that's just. And here's Chris and Carolyn's corner room with their own private balcony. It's pretty cool, Dad. Yeah. What's tomorrow? <laughs> Let's don't even talk about What's that. What's tomorrow? Oh, it's just uh, another day. It's your birthday. Yay! How do you feel about waking up on your birthday with that view? Actually, this makes getting as old as I am tomorrow not so bad when I get to do that. But you know, you look really good for 42. Uh, uh, thank you. Yeah, <laughs> He's not 42. <laughs> Good morning. It's the second full day here. We didn't really do much last night because we wanted to just kind of enjoy this. So we sat out here and we had drinks and we watched the sunset and ate chips and salsa. And <laughs> I forgot to make any other food because I just filled up so much on chips and salsa. But um, today is a very special day because it is Papa Jancy's birthday. So him and my mom and Jacqueline and Mark were out playing tennis. I was just getting a little bit of work done because it's Friday and then hopefully the next couple days I won't have as much to do. And now I'm getting ready for the day, but I'm just pretty much gonna do, I have tinted sunscreen and concealer and maybe some mascara because I don't exactly know what we're doing, but I bet it's something outdoorsy. And then we're gonna try to do a birthday dinner out and on the town for dad tonight. I've been living in this cardigan inside in the AC. I've been loving it, it's so soft and comfy and both mom and Jacqueline complimented me on it. So we will see where the adventure takes us, but hello, good morning, happy you're here and happy to spend another day with you. down to another day, another beach. I don't know if you can hear me with all the wind, but I love how this whole beach is literally shaded and Jordy already, already made it into the water, but the water is like bright blue. There he is. <laughs> My merman. We just got back to, from hiking to a beach to snorkel a little bit. And I didn't realize I can't snorkel because I can't put the snorkel goggles over my nose. <laughs> but I still got in the water and I, I haven't experienced beach hair in my adulthood very much. 
hardly ever actually, which is funny because I lived in Southern California for so long, but it's the water's so cold there. <laughs> but I'm laughing because I have like that smart ring that tracks steps and activity and all sorts of things. And I took it off because I knew it'd be snorkeling. And I'm like, oh man, my ring would be so proud of me if it knows how far I just hiked and how many steps I walked up because I haven't really done any activity since the surgery seven weeks ago. So I want my ring to tell me good job. And it has no idea all that I just did. But we are going to go to the pool for a bit. It's great because it's now like three o'clock here. So it's 8 p.m. back home on a Friday. So no more work emails are coming through or anything like that. So for the next few days, I feel like I just got a free pass to kind of turn off my brain, which is really nice. So about to really enter like vacation vibe mode. And I'm glad for that. So there's actually no shade at the pool. Good, mm. good sunscreen application. Thanks. Way to protect. Um, <laughs> so I'm letting Jordy <laughs> dictate what surprise adventure he wants to go on, and I'm just gonna follow along like the passenger princess I am. Let's let's figure it out. I'm excited. No, I think I think you should. Nope, nope, go where your yet. heart takes you. We'll see. Where your heart desires, and maybe we can end with a snow cone. What? Okay. Did I say that? What? She said it. Actually, it's a weekend. The snow cone line's gonna be crazy. Maybe not today. I'll shave ice, actually. Oh, it is shaved ice, you're right. You made it. I made it. why the best feeling is showering after the beach. Oh, we ran into Jacqueline and Mark in town. They walked across the whole bay and had to swim, had to swim to get into town. I'm updating the vlog on some drama. And we ran into them completely wet and they were like, we're gonna go get a Mai Tai. So got a Mai Tai with them and gave them a ride back. They said it took an hour to walk and swim into town. <laughs> and now we've all showered and gotten ready and showering after the beach feels so good, but I'm trying not to wash my hair every day, so I just put my crazy beach hair up in a pony. This is the look for dinner. Just got shorts, this cardigan, white tank, and we're about to open dad's birthday presents before going to his birthday dinner. And then the boys got him cigars and stuff to make Mai Tais for after dinner. So full party vibes over here. Let's Happy 21st! Happy 21st. Ah, is it yeah, it yeah. does. We won't say how many years beyond this. 21 times three minus a few. Yep. You know, <laughs> what? Very cool. But open it. Ooh, <laughs> it has our dog all over it. God. It's covered in pictures of May. Is that right? Mai Tais tonight. Oh, oh your Tais. Wow. Oh my gosh. This? Mm -hmm. that for was... Mai Tais, not for... That and you know how to do it? I mean, it looks pretty simple, we'll you know. Some, uh, <laughs> yeah. That's right, yeah. Time. For the boys. Oh. That's right. So you, you, just, you just pick the night. We're in. Okay. Mm -hmm. I love it. All right. Good morning, it's the next day. We're striking out to a farmer's market, which will be really fun, and then we're gonna, woo! Good morning, sun. Then we're gonna go get brunch at a spot that I have wanted to take everyone to. It's called Hanalei Bread Company. They do gluten-free things, but also just like normal good brunch stuff before everybody else strikes out on a hike, which I think I'm bowing out of. We'll talk more about that later, but excited to see what a Hawaiian farmer's market is like. I'm sure there's a lot of fruit and macadamia nuts. <laughs> this field makes me actually kind of want to learn how to play soccer. Hey Jordan, would you play soccer if it was in that field? Yeah. Doesn't it like kind of make you want to like try a sport? Just to frolic in that field? Let's do it. <laughs> you. But like not enough. And we found the Hanalei Saturday Market. I'm so excited to see what is here. So over here seems like all kind of like handmade like arts things. 
I'm look. I'm looking for the food. I thought you were talking to me. No, I I'm mean, just describing the place. <laughs> yeah, so in case you, in case you're not noticing, the soul seems to be kind of the arts. Thank you. Yeah, you're welcome. We just got a sample of this, and it is so good. It's like a Lilikoi sugar butter eggs are the ingredients, but we got that for toast. Hey, what did you get? I got some ahi rolls. What, are, what is it? Tuna rolls. Oh, those are tuna rolls. Yep. And a little pork skewer. Pork skewer. They're in line to get some bananas, but Mark makes friends everywhere he goes, so he's made a friend. <laughs> hey, what'd you get? We got fried bananas. Oh, wait, you don't have it. You have it. <laughs> My knee on the table. Uh oh. Let me, see, let me see those. Let me see them. Wow. Look good. And just look. Look at the taro fields. I still don't know if it's taro or taro. I keep going back and forth between the two. I got really excited to find gluten-free things, so I think I overdid it. These are both gluten-free toasts and a waffle and a burrito and a breakfast sandwich. I'm gonna do a taste test of this one with y'all, which has gluten-free bread, ricotta, apple, um, some other sort of cheese, some sort of walnut. Do you remember what else? No. It's kind of sweet and savory. That looks amazing. I know, it looks really good. Wow. I'm making a mess. Fun experience. So everybody went to go hike the Nepali coast, which was pretty hard to get tickets. Mom woke up every morning at like 5 a.m. Texas time to try to reserve tickets. She finally got some, but this whole week so far, we've been walking just like a few miles a day, kind of hiking up and down to beaches, and I have been wiped. It's been my first time really moving a lot since the surgery and I also life has been so 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 busy like Jordy proposed in Alabama I came home for just a few days I threw that baby shower I flew here there's been some other really big things happening that I haven't shared with the vlog yet that I'll share later all within the span of like less than two weeks and I have not had a time to just kind of like sit down and process it all so I made the executive decision to stay back and stay home while everybody does this hike for a few hours. And I've just been kind of catching up on things. And then I'm going to just have some quiet time and process everything that's happened in the last couple weeks. And so I decided that this morning. And then dad went to go play tennis after I decided that and he threw out his back. So he's in there napping. So two of us are home, the rest of us are hiking. But this is like the ideal vacation for me is having some time to just like sit in beauty and rest and process. My family is so active. They're so active. I'm an active person in terms of just like doing a lot in one day and they are like 10 times me. So I think it's good for me to bow out of a couple activities and like actually take some time to regroup and rest up and recharge. My fellow autoimmune or chronic illness girlies might relate to that. <laughs> Health first. Good morning, it's a new day. It's a new day. We're about to go on a kayaking adventure with mom and dad. Jacqueline and Mark are golfing, but we're getting kayaks here, which is right next to the, I still need to learn if it's taro or taro. I'm sure the internet will tell me very quickly, but um, there's a smoothie truck that when we, we used to come as kids a bit, and I would literally go get a taro smoothie every day at the smoothie truck, and it's still here. So we're gonna get one of those for old time's sake, for memories, see if they're the same. I remember them being very tart, but I think that that was in the phase Tarot. where I wasn't allowed to eat sugar, mm. so we would take out all the sugary things. <laughs> so it's basically like a vegetable smoothie. <laughs> we'll see. You what? I gotta Mom's also worried about pronouncing something wrong to the to the locals, so it runs in the family. Also found out that this taro mochi cake is gluten free, so should I do a little bite test? A little bite test, a little sip test? Look at the texture of that. Look at that bounce. Mmm! It's light. It's cute. <laughs> Good. Do you get the taro? Can you taste it? But I know there's a lot of fruits in there. It's Something a little like a little tart. Mm -hmm. Change in plans. The uh, kayak spot was closed. So, mom, where are we going? Hoopa Falls. It's a mile hike each direction to falls in a swimming hole. Yeah. To falls in a swimming hole. So we are. I'm not wearing the best hiking shoes. They're pretty platformy. <laughs> kind of am tempted to just go barefoot as God intended, you know? 
Here we are adding all these contraptions to our feet, trying to make things easier, and I, I think it makes it harder, actually. It's a little bit later, I hope you can hear me with the wind, but we got some grocery store pokey and we're on the south side of the island where there's a bit of surf right now and Jordy's heading out with his boogie board. There he goes. And the best part of all of this is there's a lighthouse down there. Do you see the lighthouse? And the boogie boarder? Please appreciate Jordy the lighthouse and now a rainbow. Good morning. It is the last full day here and I'm excited for today because we are going to go snorkeling. We are going to bring the GoPro. We're going to Tunnels Beach, which everyone else went there earlier this week and they said it was the best snorkeling they've seen in a long time. So I'm not even getting ready for the day because we're just going to go straight there to try to get parking because it's pretty popular. Last day here. Oh, this week has flown by. Those, those are all the updates I have. Family's eating breakfast. Pretty cute. Okay, let's go snorkel. We got parking, we've made it to Tunnels Beach. It's so pretty and like pretty empty. The water's so blue, the mountains. I'm really happy about it. The snorkeling is right along this wreath right here on the other side. There's like tide pools on this side and snorkeling on that side. But all this cool big lava rock is just so cool. I don't know if you can hear me. And it's always a mystery whenever I film on a beach because it's so windy. See, we did some pretty cool snorkeling. Yeah. Uh, day before yesterday. Yeah. And then getting to play tennis with this guy's been. This guy, Mr. Tennis himself. Yeah. Those so. are good things. And then just chilling with the family. Yeah, it's a pretty good setup, awesome. huh? Yeah. Pretty good setup. Yeah, dead one setup. Oh, and bit. then I forgot one more thing. What? Listening to that guy play the guitar. Oh, He's just yeah. like just like the bomb You've so had anyway private, private shows and, and and your mom keeps telling me stop asking him to play music because she thinks i'm really doing a big imposition on him so. uh this boy lives and breathes oh, yeah, music yeah, yeah. good to go yeah we're off on one more adventure for the day to end off this trip mom what are you gonna do i am going to try to surf she's gonna surf baby or at least try, but I don't know. We're walking along a roadside with like corn or something. So I'm not feeling very confident. They're about to head out surfing beyond the reef. I think I'm gonna stay back and swim in this very chill water right here. Yeah, She's getting her first lesson. Yep, that's exactly right. And you get as close to the sideways as you can. Four more times. Okay. Yeah. Drop and give me ten. One, two, three. Push up. Yeah, that's it. That's exactly right. Okay. And with that, we're.
we're back home on my favorite spot, our patio. Um, I think I'm going to be present and enjoy with the family tonight. One last sunset dinner. We might just stay here on this porch and eat dinner at home and then walk down to the beach and try to get family pictures on the beach. And I will be whipping out that cute dress. But it's such a fun day. Honestly, that last beach that we were at, just getting to swim in the water was my favorite out of all the beaches we went to because it was so much still water and so you just could just hang out there all day. So that was really a fun experience. It was fun to have a full day, just beachy and <laughs> beach hair is just so funny to me. I never see my hair just wild ever, ever, but it was fun to have a just kind of roll out of bed and go on an adventure kind of day. But speaking of my cute dress, thank you to Abercrombie for partnering with me on this video. Don't forget that sale that is happening, YouTube AF for 20% off your order throughout those days. I think it's the 21st through the 27th. And I'll have all the pieces that I got linked down below. But thanks for spending a week with me in Hawaii. As I alluded to, there's some really big things happening in my life right now. So stay tuned. I'm gonna have a lot to catch y'all up on. Um, it's gonna be a fun adventure. I love you. I hope you have the best rest of your day and I'll see you in another video very soon. Bye from Hawaii. Oh, it's raining. It's raining over there. Look at them, they're all in the clouds. Bye.